But I call the member for Lindsay. Thank you, Mr Deputy Speaker. Months of lockdown, hundreds of thousands of missed lessons and a tragic rise in drowning rates over the last year. We're on a path towards a national tragedy this summer. I met with so many local swim schools and that's why we worked hard to put water safety in the fast lane, reopen pools and get kids back to local swim schools with an intensive back to swim program. Our campaign had thousands of people behind it to ensure we avoided a wave of drownings as we reopen and head back to the beaches, the rivers, the lakes and the pools. We scored a victory when the New South Wales government brought forward the reopening of indoor pools to 80 per cent, then again it was moved forward to 70 per cent. Today we've made another massive breakthrough with the New South Wales government announcing the first lap Learn to Swim voucher program, helping children aged three to six years old access swimming lessons. To all the parents, families, swim schools and community members who got behind my petition, your voices have been heard. We push for change. It's now being delivered. And it's great news. But drownings in the children not for age group are up 108 per cent on last year. We also need to get this age group back in the pool and into swimming lessons. And I encourage the New South Wales government to extend the voucher to our littlest learn to swimmers. Let's get kids back to their swimming lessons and put water safety in the fast lane.